screensavers. It's good to see you. Happy you're joining me this morning. We're joining us and our morning walk. It's about uh, 445, 60 degrees. It's supposed to be at about 85 this afternoon. So the house is going to get a little warm, but uh, really enjoy these warm summer days. It's cool and crisp in the morning. Just a beautiful, beautiful day. Well, the horse show went really well. We had a fantastic time. There's some video on that if you didn't see that. Uh, this week's savored thought theme is around animals since we were with horses all week and it was just a really good time. Uh, quote for the day, or the thought for the day is uh, from Jane Goodall. She was the um, gorilla lady back in the 70s as I was growing up. We saw a lot of uh, footage from her. I like some animals more than people, and some people more than animals. Well, that just makes sense. Um, really interesting. I, Tanya's been riding horses for, well, since she was 16, but um, taking lessons from Tim uh, for about four or five years now. And I just started about four months ago. And so this horse show thing was really an interesting perspective for me, uh, just being up there for, what, three days, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And um, just to see the different, the different personalities of people, of course, we know that, but the different personalities of animals as well. Um, of course, you know, we have dogs and we have dogs, and they all have their own personalities, but to see how personable they are uh, and then depending on the day sometimes they're a, more of a handful than other days just like people but it's uh, like Jane she lived out in the jungle essentially with a one let's see not a herd not a pack uh, with one group of gorillas and got to know them over I think 20 30 years um, as part of the pack, she would <laughs> essentially go in and uh, mimic grooming, and she really be, did become part of the pack. And they had some <laughs> really sweet, nice gorillas and some real a-holes too. So just like just like people, but um, that's there's something different. Or we were still trying to figure it out last night. Like, why did we enjoy that so much? It's, I mean, Tanya loves horses. I'm beginning to appreciate them more, I think. But uh, I don't know if you have any animal stories or, uh, you know, certain connections you've had over time. If you've lost animals, love to hear your comments and your thoughts. Uh, if you've been an animal person, you've lost an animal just like humans. And, uh, it's tough. Love to hear your thoughts. Boy, we haven't had a morning walk for a few days. I don't know what Frank's been up to. Where you at, buddy? Hmm. Here's our security flamingo. Frank, my goodness, just nestled in the bush. Good morning, Frank, we missed you. Just sitting out in the backyard, it's a beautiful day, about 80 degrees. Uh, took a little break from work. The dogs are out in the sun. mindfulness I guess. Feeling the breeze and smelling the flowers and playing a little ukulele. Um, for dinner tonight we're having uh, burgers or hamburger patties. We don't eat buns typically. Uh, so burgers on the grill and some sweet potatoes. So really simple 
It's a good 15 minute meal if you're wanting to have something hearty and healthy and uh, quick so you too can play your version of the uke or whatever you do for fun. Um, definitely check that out. It'll be coming up next. Okay, this is a simple, dimple, easy peasy, lemon squeezy meal. So we have a pound of uh, grass-fed beef. You can use any kind you want. That's what we're using. Uh, two sweet potatoes. So this is for two people. If you want to do four, multiply. Figure it out. Salt, pepper, olive oil. So what we're going to do is pat this out into four pats. So a quarter pound burgers each. A little Tillamook pepper jack cheese. You don't have to add it. And then slice the sweet potatoes. I put these in the microwave before uh, the beginning of the day for about six minutes so they're nice and tender and soft. I'm going to be slicing those up, oil them down with a little olive oil, salt and pepper once again. You could make this Mexican, you could make this Thai, you could make this whatever you want, but it's a really simple meal. I've got the grill going already, um, so we're going to make four patties, grill them, slice this up grill them and then put a little pepper jack cheese I love Tillamook oh cheese it's good and grill them and if you wanted to do four ounce portions you could have one patty for dinner tonight and if you do salads take the next patty to uh, for lunch tomorrow with a salad great sweet potatoes super healthy and uh, Bada bing, bada dinner. And I'm guessing, let's find my trusty, ever present, except for right now, timer. Yeah. Okay, we tossed them on the grill. Looking for grill marks. The sweet potatoes are already done. So we're just essentially grilling them and adding a little flavor to them. You could salt and pepper those, you could teriyaki them, you could fish sauce them. With the burgers, it's just salt and pepper, but you could do whatever you want to. Barbecue, you could add some chili paste, you could add Italian seasoning, you could do this with Italian sausage, anything and everything. And then we're going to add a little cheese. My baby likes, likes cheese on her burgers, so we've got some pepper jack in the fridge. Melt that down a little bit. And this is a quick, yummy. I didn't find the timer, but I put it on the, the stove timer, so we'll see how long this takes. This took 14 minutes and 57 seconds, so under 15 minutes. Uh, grilled burger with pepper jack cheese and grilled sweet potatoes. So, simple, easy way to eat a healthy dinner and um, Save a little time for you and the ones you love.